हेलो स्टूडेंट्स होप यू आर ऑट डूइंग वेल आवर सब्जेक्ट इज रिसर्च मेटोडोलॉजी इन एजुकेशनल एंड आवर कोर्स कोड इज़ एट सिक्स जीरो फोर एंड आवर चैप्टर इज यूनिट नंबर फाइव डिस्क्रिप्टिव रिसर्च डिज़ाइन एंड यू कैन डाउनलोड योर बुक फ्रॉम अलामा अकबर ओपन यूनिवर्सिटी ऑनलाइन टू देर वेबसाइट अबाउट बी एड क्लासेज एंड सो यू कैन स्टडी Well, according to the syllabus, as I am giving you lectures on it. So let's begin our lecture. Objectives. It is expected that after going through the through this unit, you will be able to number one differentiate between the experimental and descriptive research. Number two, distinguish between the various types of descriptive researches. Number three, state as what type of descriptive research can be planned in the field of educational planning and management. Number four, plan and desire descriptive research study for your master's thesis. Number five, study the descriptive research report with increasing efficiency. And number six. determine what type of descriptive study can be used at various stages or stages of the planning cycle students now we're going to study about introduction you have already studied the hist historical and the experimental type of research in this unit an attempt has been made to explain descriptive research which is predominated research methods of the behavior science you may have an experiment makes the hypothesis alternate in a critical analysis of the problems at the and the hand of planning his making ob observations which may confirm or reject reject his hypothesis the prevention uh, practice of the social scientist is according to the systematic exa examine and analysis of the behavior under the condition the naturally occur in the home the classroom the community etc hereby lies in the advantages of descriptive research we we'll first be going to understand about what is descriptive research in descriptive research the investigation does not manipulate the variable or arrange the event to happen descriptive research involves events that have already taken place or, or would have taken place even though there had been no observation or uh, description the important of the type of uh, research lies in the fact that no much program can be made in solving problem uh, useless v possess descriptive of the phenomena with which we work students now we going to study about step in descriptive research in descriptive studies the researchers follow certain procedure and steps do not merely present provide the data in observations uh, a good research contains examining examining their problematic situation define their problem and sometimes state their hypothesis listen the list the assumptions upon what their hypothesis and procedures are based select appropriate subject and source material select or construct construct techniques for collecting the data establish characteristics for classes the data that are unambiguous approaches for the study and uh, capable of bringing about significant likeness differences or relationship validity the data ga gathering techniques making this discrimination an objective observation describe analysis and interpretation their findings clear precise in precise terms students now we going to study about 
सर्वे स्टडी सर्वे स्टडीज वट इज सर्वे स्टडी अकॉर्डिंग टू द कैटर वी गुड द पर्पज ऑफ द डिस्क्रिप्टिव सर्वे स्टडी मे बी नंबर टू सिक्योर एविडेंस कंसर्निंग द एग्जिस्टिंग सिचुएशन और करंट से कंडीशन टू आइडेंटिफाई स्टैंडर्ड और नॉर्म्स विच हैपन टू कंपेयर द प्रजेंट कंडीशन टू डिटर्मिन हाउ टू मेक द न्यू स्टेप्स हैविंग द डिटर्मिन विद द वे एंड हाउ विश टू गो द सर्वे स्टडी essentially a uh, research and is daily distinguished from the general report but this purpose a uh, survey or study should be fully followed criteria type of survey studies the following are the few types of uh, survey studies स्कूल सर्वे पब्लिक ओपिनियन सर्वे कम्युनिटी सर्वे डॉक्यूमेंट्री एनालिसिस जॉब एनालिसिस फॉलो अप स्टडीज फर्स्ट स्टूडेंट वी लुक अबाउट स्कूल सर्वे इन स्कूल सर्वे द फॉलोइंग सिस्टम्स आर कम एम्स आउटकम पीपल अचीवमेंट्स करिकुलम मैटर्स एंड इंस्ट्रूमेंटल एड्स एडमिनिस्ट्रेशन प्रॉब्लम एंड प्रोसीजर्स ऑफ द स्कूल फाइनेंशियल पॉलिसी स्टाफ एंड पर्सनल पब्लिक ट्रांसपोर्ट स्कूल प्लानिंग इन टाइप ऑफ स्कूल सर्वे देर आर द आउटसाइड एक्सपर्ट सर्वे द सेल्फ सर्वे द कॉपरेटिव सर्वे कम्स इन students next is data sought in school survey in this the setting for learning the characteristic for educational personnel the nature of pupils the nature of educational process comes in in public opinion survey an educational plan have to be made many decisions just as an industrial or a political leader he can formulate policies either on the basis of proper research blind uh, guesses or pressure groups demands there immediate reactions rather than more permanent attitude towards the program comes in students the next is community survey a close relationship exist between educational sector and the community educator often collect data about the local setting and particular aspects of life in it the scope of depending on the community survey is determined by the nature of the problem the amount of the time and money qualified leadership and willingness of the community to cooperate community survey investigates uses quality uh, quantity questionnaires interviews and direct observation they collect the data from the teacher student and administration and adopt an interdisciplinary approach to collect information about the various social processes students the next is documentary analysis the documentary analysis is called a content analysis or information analysis it is similar to his historical research and both methods required experiment experimentation of existing records but historical re- research is related with the distinct past while documentary analysis is a type of descriptive research is concerned with the present and it in conclude the documentary scope of official record and report uh, printed form textbooks letter autobiography uh, letter autobiography diaries picture films and cartoons whereas the documentary analysis undertaken into to describe the prevention of condition and practices the discovery of related important and interest in certain topic of problem
Okay, now we're going to study about job analysis. The technique is used to apply to study administration, teaching, and non-instrumental priorities. In this type of research, data is often ge generated about the general duties and responsibility of workers and their special achievements. Uh, and its uh, administration to deduct the uh, weakness, duplication, or inefficiency, establish a uniform classification for simpler work, identify the competencies, assigning workers to job based, situated to each worker to put the ability, manpower to be best used, set up a training program, and establish and for promotion and the last is follow-up study the follow-up study investigates in individual who leave a uh, institution after completing a uh, program or a course of study the study aim it uh, what happened to the program or institute had happened follow-up study is depend and determined to edit or inadequacy of the program with the help of the opinion and the other people work in various aspects of their courses or programs in the light of actual result students now we're going to study about interrelationship studies educate educationists collect facts to obtain the accurate describe of the existing uh, status um, and they are making the effort to track the inter, uh, inter uh, relationships on the basis of case studies casual comp comparative study correlated studies so first is case study when the focus of attention is directed towards a single case or a limited number of case the procedure is personalized and such as research are in included in the case study method and descriptive research whereas in case comparative study the some researchers while carrying out descriptive research not only try to discover what a phenomenon is but also how and why it occurs then they try to factors of uh, circumstances rather than events on the particular assumption to occur in the phenomenon whereas the experimental study can be done but the but this provide a way to probably the problems that cannot be uh, solved in the laboratory situation and our third is correlation studies descriptive description of phenomena are sometimes made by employing the uh, correlate correlation techniques which help in escalating the extent to which two variables are related to or extend to variables in which the one factor corp corresponding while variables in another factor the in this type of study do not monopolize the inadequate variable but he merely take an observation to both the independent and a dependent variable as there is a current natural setting in all of the limitation to which cause compare studies are subjected since students now we're going to study about developmental studies the concept of developmental study in essentially biological and has been most commonly associated with the living structures and life process however the concept has been come to the applied to physical system as well as social institution cultural and systems of ideas in which say number one the the two types of development studies that can be used to field educational planning and management are growing uh, studies and trend project studies described as below number one is growth study a planning for the success and uh, realistic planning has been fully 
aware of the change taking place in the area of affect his field uh, uh, aspects of growth are first observe and move forward to reach optimized development uh, educational development being adopted by the country at the comparable life of social economical growth ten projected studies also called a predictive study or another integrating application or descriptive method. This type of research is based on the longitudinal of the records data and has been applied to the basis of the situations and, and the uh, likely what happens. Number next is. Planning cycle and descriptive research. Now, it looks like a planning cycle is deducted about the types of the research and is used in duration of planning and uh, diagnostic reasons for failure or can be used to formulate the policy stage we can document analyze to previous uh, policies planning and other relevant documentation we can also carry the documentation analysis of the plan and policies of the other development countries at approach and level of social economical level the program such as studies can be high, highly suggested for evaluating new strategies in last in concluding remarks in spite of improvement made in recent year in research technology techniques the analysis and measurement of the social phenomena remains less highly developed than in physical science some variable relevant to education has been identified isolated and prescribed has been knowledge and various of the and the number of the statistical techniques have been developed which are enabled to researchers to measure the influence and variables more factors work in is begin and minimize the source of the error and measurement devices used to obtain data in a descriptive research after studying these units you should be able to undertake a descriptive research and also to evaluate the result of the such studies so thank you students for watching this lecture hope you understand so let's meet in next lecture